Hello everyone, welcome to another song reaction. <clears throat> this is taken from my April submissions here on r slash Alex Heights. And over here, if you'd like to post your own song or album reaction suggestions, we're doing one track per user till we're caught up to the present. Um, and we're all the way down here, almost done with this month. Um, I apologize, Kindly Beautiful, I'm skipping this because I, this is probably your music video. It has like very few views. I listened to a little bit of it. It's not my type of music. Um, I don't mind people submitting their own music if that's what that is, um, but I'm sorry. <laughs> I, in 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 light of things that will get views and moving forward to the present, I uh, unfortunately have to skip that one. Um, I have heard this track because it was featured in Twin Peaks season three, so we will be doing Heat Miser half right. Uh, I didn't know this, this this was a thing. Um, one of the outfits that Elliot Smith was a part of for a little while, that's about five years. Um, I don't think I know any of these other musicians. Just did three albums. It looks like the last one being the only notable one. Um, and this song did appear on uh, the unreleased posthumous stuff uh from new moon so uh I, I assume that's his own version of the track and then we'll be listening to the heat miser version which is an unlisted track here on mike city suns um just looks like kind of typical maybe a little bit more electric based than the acoustic stuff that uh elliot usually does but we'll see we'll see what we got here i have no idea what to expect um if you guys end up enjoying the video these are the things you must do to continue forward successfully in life. Um, okay, without further ado, let us go ahead and uh, give Half Right a listen.
that was great. What a great track. Man, every time, every time I listen to another thing that Elliot Smith has done, I'm like, I can't wait to listen to Elliot Smith. I have, um, I have reacted to either or on this channel. You can go check that out if you desire. Um, I do have basically like all of his discography, um, on my reaction schedule. So that will happen at some point down the road. So don't, no need to request that I do Elliot Smith at some point. Um, it, it's just fantastic. Like I, I love folk guitar type stuff or even like, uh, not necessarily folk. There are folk artists who do this, but like Elliot Smith, I mean, would you, yeah, I guess you could call him folk. There's something a little more like indie rock about him at times though. I don't know. I mean, yeah, the, the whole, um, when I did my uh, Blood on the Tracks Bob Dylan thing, everyone was like lambasting me for calling it folk. And I'm like, are you okay? Are you high? <laughs> What's going on? Um, I love guitarists who use, you know, acoustic guitar primarily. Uh, Cat Stevens, Elliot Smith, they do this. Um, just c come up with very interesting chord shapes, very interesting, like, riffs and tones um, through what they're playing on the guitar. And that's always been very inspirational for me. And if anyone has listened to my music, especially the last album I came out with in 2020, um, features a lot of that same type of songwriting style, uh, as far as like just interesting chord structures and shapes, um, kind of unorthodox, I suppose. And uh, even just hearing this, like super basic music theory wise, um, but just that really nice, simple, uh, kind of bouncing back and forth, almost like an octave on the guitar through the whole thing was just very nice, very sublime. I dig it. Thank you for the recommendation, whoever it was. Uh, Antique Theme, thank you so much. If you guys enjoyed the video, like I said, these are the things you must do to continue having a moral life. Um, I gave you good content. Give me the likes. Anyway, I'm going to go. Thank you all for watching. Until next time, Godspeed.